Hello one, hello all. It looks like Nidus Prime has dropped before Plague Star in a little like pre-update patch. So let's take a look. Hilariously enough, it looks like Operation Plague Star will be here in 30, 31 minutes, but Nidus Prime is in the game it looks like. The Prime access may not be out yet, but some of the stuff has been pre-dropped. So things like some of the skins, I think, Nidus Prime. Oh my god, there it is, beautiful. Oh, we see Nidus Prime. Look at that. Look at that Nidus Prime. Lith N7, that is where you get Nidus Prime chassis blueprint, right? Get it at all the easy places. Oh, Hemosite, that is with the new Plague Star event, so keep that in mind. You can get these just running the new Plague Star event. You can get them all over as well. Until the events are over, I would straight up just run Plague Star. You get free formas, okay? Free formas. We're gonna be talking about this a lot in the next week. Okay, so definitely farm the Plague Star event for forma, ghoul saw, items, Nidus Prime relics, all of that, right? And then other than that, farm it wherever you want to. It's a Lith relic, right? They drop in a ton of places. It's hard to say whether this is a drop yet in the game or if they just coded it into the codex, but by the time this is up as a video, it will be, and pretty much by the time Plague Star drops, it'll be up. So yeah, remember, get farming. The second relic is Meso B5, and it looks like that gets you Nidus Prime Systems Blueprint. Okay, not too bad, can't complain, it's the common drop, so easy peasy. Again, it drops from all of the regular, like, relic pack sources and the event Hemosite from Plague Star. Since it's a Meso relic, you can pretty much run anything and get it. Because Mesos drop like hotcakes, along with Lith. So for Plague Star, I'm gonna be running the Exceltra. Okay, we're gonna check out how that works. Next, we have Neo N16. No shock there. Hemosite, same stuff, draw places, Steel Path, Arcwing, all the same relic packs all over. It's a Neo Relic. It looks like this is just going to be common drops for the entirety of the star chart. So that's how you get most of the Nidus Prime parts. And this is the Nidus Prime Neuroptics. It's the Neo Relic. Luckily, I easily get a lot of Neos, so I don't mind that one being the rare drop. Ooh, Isolation Vault, Tier 1. And then finally, right, you got Axie A14, the one, the only. And that'll give you the beautiful Nidus Prime blueprints, right? It's an uncommon drop, so it shouldn't take as long as the last one, but hey, it's an Axie, so I always go to do, 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 Lua Apollo, the favorite place amongst everyone. So get farming, everyone. Remember, run Plague Star event, okay? Just keep going. If you can, just run it as much as you possibly can, because it is definitely something that will give you all of the relics for Nidus Prime. It'll give you all of the new items, all Forma, the Ghoul Saw, okay? It's a very exciting time in Warframe. The event, I believe, is until September 30th, question mark? So, I believe it's until then. So, we have, what, like two, three weeks? So, yeah. Remember when the relics swap out and all that to check the codex? because that's how relics work. So yeah, thank you, love you, all that jazz, subscribe, favorite stuff, and I will see you next time.